That looks really cool. I can't. I, it's a little small for me, but it looks really cool, Sarah. Good morning. Hey, good morning, Kelvin. Yes, I don't think you, your wife, and your three kids could fit in this, but eventually, <laughs> because we know that everything is being electrified, all forms of transportation, eventually we'll get you five seats that you could take your whole family in. But yes, I'm joined by Scott Burgess this morning. We are here at the Santa Monica Airport, and the exciting thing is, is we have an actual FAA certified electric plane here. Tell us more, Scott. This is the very first electric airplane certified by the FAA. They've been working on this technology, many projects all over the world for 20 to 25 years. Uh, it's finally here. So this technology is going to revolutionize travel. It's clean, quiet, much lower cost, and it's going to be more inclusive. So it's going to revolutionize how we travel. Even just getting an air ticket, air taxis, the operational cost per hour of the air taxis are much less. So if you want to fly from Santa Monica to Burbank, 50 bucks, 15 minutes during rush hour. That's perfect. And you get there so much faster than getting an Uber or driving yourself. So I, I'm looking at this. Um, this is the charger. Can you show us how this works? I imagine it's just like plugging in for your electric vehicle. Just like an EV. So this plugs into 220. Uh, or if you've got phase three, you can plug in and it'll charge faster. But then this is just like you would plug into your Tesla or Volt or whatever. Here you go. And how long does it take to charge this plane? This plane, it, if you fly for one hour, it'll take about an hour and 20 minutes to fully charge. But just remember, this is the very first plane that got certified. And it's the smallest. It's for flight training. More and more airplanes are coming. They're in development. They're coming out. Longer charge or longer flight times, bigger payloads, uh, more practicality, less charge times. Yeah. It's every month there's all these enabling technologies that are being improved. So this is the future, but it begins now here at Santa Monica Airport. Amazing. So I want to take you to the other side of this plane and also introduce you to one of the pilots that gets to fly this and train a lot of the up and coming pilots. This is Luke. Thank you so much for joining us this of morning. Of course. So you get to train a lot of up and coming pilots. I'm going to have you. Uh, yeah, you can stand right there. Tell us what is maybe the most fun thing about flying this and how is it different than a regular airplane? You know, I would say it's simplicity. Um, it's really easy to fly. It's very stable. And the most fun thing about it is you can kind of do whatever you want in it, as long as you're not breaking FAA regulations, of course. Um, but it's a very stable trainer aircraft. So if I'm bringing a new student in it, yep. I can let them do the takeoff on the first flight. I can let them fly around, do whatever they want to do, play with the aircraft, experience flying for the first time, and they're at the controls the entire time. And that's what I love about it. And I'm seeing, so this is where the battery is. Give us a little bit of the technical specs. How many batteries in here? How far can you take this on a charge? Mm -hmm. So we have two batteries. We have one located right there and another one in the back. We also have a liquid coolant within this area here. And so on a normal charge, you can take it about, um, I'd say 50 minutes to an hour, uh, standard with FAA regulations. Um, and what we will usually do is take it up, go over to the Palisades, Malibu area, do some maneuvers, and then come back for landings training. Amazing. And we know that the aviation industry needs up-and-coming pilots. You are helping to bridge that gap and bring them into the pipeline. Uh, Kelvin, it's an exciting day to actually see an electric aircraft and what is possible and what we will be seeing more of as the future unfolds.